It's probably safe to say that no one had global pandemic on their 2020 bingo card. But as the dust settles on a year filled with unprecedented developments, medical, economic, and political, it's time to look ahead to 2021 and the equity investing opportunities it offers. But the new year doesn't promise any less uncertainty than its predecessor, so investors should remain cautious, as always. In this video, we will tell you about 7 best stocks to buy right now. Number 7. Facebook It's more or less tradition now to include Facebook among the annual list of U.S. News' best stocks to buy. 2021 will be Facebook's fifth straight year on the list with shares up 172% since first being named in 2017. For comparison, the S&P 500 is up 85% over the same period. FB is a singular company due to its unprecedented scale and user engagement. Its Facebook platform alone has 2.74 billion MAUs, while monthly active people on its family of apps which also includes Instagram, WhatsApp, and Messenger, is at 3.21 billion. Facebook barely edges out Adobe as the stock on this list with the highest net profit margin at 32%, and opportunities to boost monetization through e-commerce. Facebook Shops, Facebook Marketplace. Facebook dating in other areas like virtual reality, Oculus, offer several long-term growth drivers. Number 6. Alibaba Group Holding Alibaba, like Facebook, is a returning pick from last year's best stocks to buy list. Baba is both massive, it's worth more than $725 billion, and growing rapidly. Sales rose about 30% last quarter. Alibaba is booming. Revenues have more than tripled in three years. The stock is booming too, but its continued upside potential makes it one of the best stocks to buy in 2021. The Chinese e-commerce platform Alibaba Group Holding has been a permanent member of Coleman's portfolio over the years. The hedge fund is holding 4.4 million shares of Baba, valued at $1.31 billion, accounting for 3.88% of the overall portfolio. The tech billionaire benefited from its investments in the largest Chinese e-commerce platform because Alibaba shares soared more than 200% in the past five years. The company has generated revenue growth of 30% in the latest quarter, while earnings per share of $2.68 topped the consensus estimated by $2.65 per share. Alibaba operates shopping platforms Tabo and Tamal and owns 33% of soon-to-be publicly traded Ant Financial, which operates Alipay, China's largest third-party online payment provider. Shares of Alibaba were up on sustained core commerce recovery benefiting from improved purchase frequency and spending per order. We believe Alibaba's core business remains highly profitable. Investors now also have a case study in how the business handles sudden shocks to the marketplace. In a year that saw a pandemic emerge, spread and shut down day-to-day -day life in much of China, Alibaba kept growing, and its stock is up about 25% to date. At 21 times forward earnings, Baba stock still trades more cheaply than most large-cap growth stocks. U.S. investors should have some exposure to Chinese companies, and Alibaba is arguably the single safest bet. Number 5. Apollo Global Management Inc. The asset management firm Apollo Global Management Inc., New York Stock Exchange, APO, is the fifth largest stock holding of Tiger Global Management. The tech billionaire Chase Coleman believes Apollo Global Management is a good stock to invest in. The hedge fund has been holding 33.9 million shares of Apollo valued at $1.5 billion. Shares of Apollo Global Management soared 200% in the last 18 months. In addition, the asset management firm also offers hefty dividends to investors. Apollo Global Management APO dropped 9.5% over the period. 
The company reported Q2 distributable earnings of $0.46, cents, just below consensus of $0.48, cents, and a quarterly dividend of $0.49 cents a share, 4.7% annualized yield. Pre-tax fee-related earnings of $259 million, $0.59 cents per share, topped estimates of $242 million, $0.55 cents per share driven by higher advisory and transaction fees, while management fees of $401.8 million were in line. Number 4. Amazon.com, Inc. The world's largest e-commerce platform, Amazon.com, is the fourth largest stock holding of tech billionaire Coleman's portfolio. It is one of the best stocks to invest in according to the tech billionaire. Tiger Global Management has recently raised its stake in the e-commerce platform by 1% to 604,800 shares valued at $1.9 billion. In a letter to investors, Barron Opportunity Fund believes Amazon will expand its market share in the days ahead. The firm said, Amazon.com Inc. is the world's largest retailer and cloud services provider as Amazon benefited from recent investments in logistics and distribution to meet increased COVID-19-related demand. Amazon has the unique ability to deliver all the necessities of life safely to your doorstep, including groceries. Amazon also reported a stunning beat in operating profit, with $5.8 billion of operating income, almost six times Wall Street's expected figure. While e-commerce penetration is rising rapidly and Amazon continues to grow its addressable market by entering new verticals, we continue to view Amazon Web Services as the more material driver of the company given its leadership in the vast and growing cloud infrastructure market and potential to compete in application software in the years to come. Number 3. Zoom Video Communications, Inc. Zoom Video Communication is a communications technology company that provides a video-first communication platform and web conferencing services. Its cloud platform offers video, voice, content sharing, and chats for mobile devices, desktops, telephones, and room systems. The platform supports up to 1,000 video participants and 10,000 viewers on a single conference call. In early November, Zoom reached a settlement agreement with the Federal Trade Commission FTC, over allegations the company misled customers about the level of security its platform offers. Among other allegations, the FTC said that as early as 2016, Zoom inaccurately claimed its services were secure with end-to-end 256-bit encryption a level of security that allows only the sender and receiver access to content sent over the Internet. Zoom agreed to implement a more robust information security program to settle the allegations. Number 2. Moderna Moderna is a clinical stage biotechnology company focused on the discovery and development of messenger RNA, mRNA, therapeutics and vaccines. It develops mRNA medicines for infectious, immuno-oncology, autoimmune, and cardiovascular diseases. Last month, Moderna disclosed that its experimental coronavirus vaccine, mRNA-1273, is 94.1% effective at preventing COVID-19 infection and has 100% efficiency with regards to stopping severe cases of COVID-19 from developing. That is astonishingly good news and is just about what we need to end the pandemic. Right now, the development stage biotech is trading at record highs, with its market capitalization hovering around $60 billion. However, there is plenty of room for shares to run even higher. Moreover, the candidate achieves such efficacy without compromising safety. Moderna has signed deals with countries across the developed world to provide over 330 million doses of mRNA-1273. The candidate is currently awaiting an Emergency Youth Authorization EUA, by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration FDA. A meeting to review its safety and efficacy is scheduled for December 17th. 
Next year, Moderna expects to produce between 500 million to 1 billion doses of mRNA-1273, which could translate to tens of billions in potential revenue. Most critically, its success in developing a coronavirus vaccine candidate serves to validate the concept behind all of its messenger RNA, mRNA program. Due to a magnitude of the coronavirus market opportunity, Moderna is arguably one of the best biotech stocks to choose from. Shares are up by over 680% year-to-date, including a 113% gain in November alone. Number 1. JD.com The Chinese e-commerce platform JD.com, NASDAQ JD, is the largest stock holding of tech billionaire Chase Coleman's portfolio. The hedge fund currently holds 51 million shares of JD, valued above $4 billion, accounting for 11.80% of the overall portfolio. JD share price soared almost 140% in the last 12 months. Hayden Capital recently pointed to the performance of JD.com in a letter to shareholders. The firm stated, We originally bought the position in March 2017, predicated on the thesis that as Chinese GDP per capita rises, consumers would increasingly place emphasis on shipping times and name brand, authentic products. In addition, as the consumer base widened and shoppers got in the habit of instant gratification due to same-day, next-day shipping, they would engage with the platform more often. The thesis was that this engagement and resulting loyalty to the platform would allow JD to branch out into higher margin general merchandise categories, which also have higher order frequencies, versus their traditional electronics and appliances, lower margin, low order frequency, which would result in higher profits and margins. That's it for today. Hope you have found the best stock for you. Do let us know if you have ever invested in stocks before. Please subscribe to the Stock Advisor. Thanks for watching.